What is up, Red Sox fans? Welcome back to Sox in the City. Today, we're going to be talking about Garrett Whitlock. This is the major league debut, however, of Garrett Whitlock. He was really impressive in spring training, a Rule 5 guy. So if you don't know about the Rule 5 draft, let me give you a quick sum up. Basically, if you're in the minors for five years and you haven't been put on the 40-man roster, you get put into this pool. And during the offseason, during the winter meetings usually, teams missing players off the 40-man roster can go and draft these players. And then you have to keep them on your team the entire season. If they get traded, that team has to keep them for the entire season, or they go back to the club you drafted them from. You're also paying them league minimum salary too. So if you get any production out of them above league, that's a steal right there. The 2-1 pitch is tied into center field, and Garrett Whitlock is going to retire the first hitter he faces in the big leagues. Kike Hernandez is there. Garrett would go on to pitch three more innings, striking out five batters in the process without letting up a run. So he's only had five innings pitched, but the five innings he did pitch looked pretty good. Eight strikeouts in total, a zero ERA. Percentile rankings looking pretty good. Got a nice chase rate, good strikeout percentage, good walk percentage. It's five innings. But what we can see is that he pounds the strike zone and he can get people to chase and swing and miss. That's a good formula. Here's a nice chart showing his velos per pitch. Fastball velo at 95 points. Average sinker velo though, 95 points. Throw in a changeup that's almost 10 miles an hour less. Whew. The sinker doesn't have the greatest vertical movement, but it's got some pretty great horizontal movement. It's just got some great movement vertically and horizontally better than league average. Not much vertical ride on the fastball, which is what you want to see to get that riding action up in the zone. So Whitlock's got a pretty nice four pitch mix here. Yeah, the slider's meh, and the fastball's not exactly what you want to see, but the sinker changeup combo is legit. That we have to keep him on this team for the whole 21 season. I think we could see him get 75 to 100 innings playing an important role on this team. This is a guy who can make a spot start here or there, or eat up some innings in a blowout game like he did the other day against Baltimore. Make sure you guys leave a like and a comment. Let me know what you think about Garrett Whitlock so far. Make sure you guys let me know what other Red Sox players you want me to break down. Thanks.